The next component it, that I'm going to discuss is phonics. And our reading rocket, Sauterkohl, defines phonics as more of a connection between sound and print, and the alphabetical principle and a tool that teachers use to facilitate making print to sound associations. And Motes and Brady sort of summarizes it as a phoneme to graphene rela relationship. And in our big ideas or in the big ideas article by the University of Oregon, there's a definition that simply says use of codes, sounds, and symbols, relationships to recognize words. So they all have a similar definition. And some of the challenges that students who are reading with would be those with dyslexia or hyperlexia where they might understand the meaning of the comprehension component of it, or they might understand the linguistic part, but are unable to recognize it visually, either in recognizing the broken down parts or aspects, the phonological awareness part of it. And leading into that, uh, phonological awareness, more specifically related to phonics rather than phonemes, is defining reading rockets as the awareness and the ability to recognize, hear, and play with sounds in the spoken language. That it is a group of skills that include a child's ability to manipulate, recognize, and break down different sections of words. And there are plenty of activities to remedy this. Blending, segmenting, chunking, counting syllables, words that rhyme, and there are many, a myriad of activities that can help children who are both what they might call regular learners and those with disabilities and twice exceptional. And those will be also listed in the bulletin board. Thank you.